So since last time Bitcoin has moved higher again. Um, the last update I was saying that it's going to move in five waves. And with the third wave here, that was on the uh, 9th of February. And then we had a pullback, wave four on the 10th of February, two days ago. Now it's moving up again, doing the fifth wave. And I think that fifth wave will end here 52,000. So not much to add. Um, it's just moving up. And uh, I'm going to have a look at, uh, at Ricoll. Um, we had a big spike in this one, but Ripple didn't make a new high because I think I've got the new high here. It just ended, the rally ended just below the previous high. I think this is more like A, B, and C. That. So I'm going to remove one, I'm going to remove two. I think it's more like an ABC. ABC. <clears throat> and, um, this means that uh, um, we are going back down again because um, maybe maybe Ripple is is tracing out a, a triangle maybe, which is like kind of A B C D E. I'm not sure what he's doing, but. Because if it was a, if it was an impulse wave going up, then from that level here, which is uh, 76, from that level, we would have a small pull, but not a big one like that. We would have come maybe to like 59, 60, something like that, and then we would have gone higher again. So the fact that we had a big pullback above, I mean below the top of that wave A, that means that it's probably doing some kind of triangle. Um, so we've got like one, two, and three. So that one is the wave A again here, coming here. Wave B. Maybe something like that, maybe. So what you what you have you have a situation where the price is going down, then it's going to go higher again. It's going to go back like that. Okay, then it's going to go down again. Maybe here. Yeah. And then this is when you will really go to new high. Okay, so that's the kind of pattern, you see? So it's, it's, it's going to be probably consolidating again for the next uh, few days or weeks. And then it will move higher. 